There are two things we should give our children. One is roots and the other is wings. Roots to stand firmly and wings to soar freely. Did it work? Yeah. I always felt like I belonged here, but I definitely needed to get out and see the wider world. But I returned home to be a contributor, to build community and to raise my family surrounded by history and family and friendships. To me, living in a rural community is about connecting to others. Some of us aren't meant to belong. Some of, some of us have to turn the world upside down and shake the hell out of it until we make our own place in it. Elizabeth Lowell. My name is Shelby. Sometimes I don't feel like I belong at all, but when I make space for myself through creative expression, human connection, and spending time in nature, I feel a sense of belonging and purpose. I was born on July the 1st, 1919. Do you want to hear the story? I am here. I am a farmer. I am a rancher. I am an entrepreneur. I am a nature lover. I am a sixth generation Nevada Countyan, born connected to the land. After the river called and I answered wading in deeply until she and I flowed together. I'm a part of her being shaped by the wisdom of water. Like the Yuba, I too am strong. We have been here for generations, countless generations before the gold rush. And we were thought to be extinct for quite a while, but we're not. I know this for a fact because I'm here. I am Jenny Woods. Anila, I am here. I've delivered hundreds of babies, but only four have come from my own body. Moving from Southern California 40 years ago, I delivered babies in homes, teepees, and even under the apple trees of Nevada County. My name is Isis Indria. I was born in this life to be of service during this great transition. And in that awareness, I dedicate my offerings to co-create a culture of belonging rooted in a remembrance that we all come from somewhere and we all have a lineage that carries a living story and living memory. The starlight within me connects us all, connecting us through story, our voice, as we experience what does it mean to be human. I am a magic maker, a media maven, a musician, an activist, a visionary, a mother, a sister, an aunt, a wife. I am the daughter of a naturalist. A we arrived in 1981 from bustling, trafficky, and mall-laden Southern California. The solid black oaks, red clay dirt, and wildflower covered meadows welcomed us. I am here to carry on what she started, a descendant of Johanna, to help reconnect the community with nature, healthy food, and learning from our indigenous people.